Let's do it. Oh dear, the cop. So basically, Against the Odds launched last week. To keep you up to speed, here's a brief of what has happened so far. While out for a walk last week, Chris found a bright purple van in a field, which had many hidden cameras. Now this was kind of strange, so he wanted to get out of there as soon as possible. Then this guy, Jolly McLoon, out of absolutely nowhere, handed him an envelope which said, Welcome to Against the Odds. But then that night, this happened. I can't sleep. Today has been one of the most strangest days of my life. The time now is 2.47 am. I feel like I'm playing this kind of game where I have to push myself out of my comfort zone. Hello? Yeah. 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 This is just insane. It was a guy who handed me the envelope. They want me to travel to Craig Avon and teach people how to ride a unicycle. This is just strange. Anyway, I'm going back to bed. So, why the unicycle? Well, let's rewind back to eight weeks ago. During lockdown, Chris decided to take up riding a unicycle, which took exactly seven days to, well, let's just say, learn. After watching this guy on Britain's Got Talent, he wanted to test himself to see if he had what it takes to accomplish this new skill. But how easy is it to teach other people? This new skill in a matter of minutes. Well, there's only one way to find out. So the team headed down to Tesco in Craig Avon. So we've actually, the first challenge of this challenge is trying to get inside the Craig Avon Tesco store. It's proven quite difficult so far. We can see people go up and down the escalators, but we actually can't get inside. Is it up this way, maybe? Right, the big challenge of this will be trying to persuade people that there's a reason why I'm bringing a unicycle into a Tesco store. Oh, found a door. <laughs> it's not coming out. And we're in, here we go. Okay, so since Thierry Henry is my favourite Arsenal player and he wore the number 14 t-shirt, I am going to unicycle up aisle number 14. So, Craig Avon Tesco's only has eight aisles and I want to go up number 14. <laughs> so, looks like it's going to be number eight. Let's do it. Oh dear, the cop. Someone then cycle forward. What? You're gonna go forward. Oh well, don't push, push. <laughs> <laughs> I need to get the other one. I need to get the other foot on first before you start going. Okay.
think you can be able to do this, Louise. No, but I'm gonna give it a go. Against the odds, let's go. That's what it's all about, okay? Love, I love Northern Ireland weather. Yes! Right, Louise, you ready for this? It's perfect conditions. <laughs> right, so put your foot, so you want to plant it. Good, plant it. Small against the odds, you two. Right, so, so what we're gonna do is there's a bit of fear here, I understand, but just try and I roll the legs. Push, good! Oh! Yeah. That's it, push, go! Oh, that's okay. Want to call out? I would love to call out Grace Boys because I feel like if anyone's gonna be able to do this, Grace is gonna be able to do it. So, Grace, you're up. It's me again. Uh, if you could just subscribe to the uh, ATO Against the Odds YouTube channel, click that wee subscribe button, hit that notification bell because we all know sometimes the notifications don't work. Uh, my YouTube is filled with uh, FIFA YouTube, KSI, the TGF Bros, all that sort of carry on. Let's get some really, really nice stuff in your sub box so you can watch when you're going to sleep or waking up in the morning, whatever, whatever floats your boat. Follow them on Instagram. Uh, give them we follow so you can check up and keep up to date with the stuff that's going on there and they don't have a facebook yet but i'm sure they will maybe at one stage so why don't you just hover about in facebook for a couple of months and whenever that comes up you can give it a wee cheeky like and get ready for some stuff on there hope you're all well see you all soon